let's go to James, who's a Spurs fan. All right, James? Good evening, James. Jamie, Jamie Gabby, how you doing, lads? I'm, I'm good, very mate. well, I'm mate. Good. It was nice for us to go top without playing. <laughs> I mean, fourth, not top. <laughs> top. Carried away. <laughs> top of Spurs. Yeah, no, guys, help me out here. I, I, I just don't understand this. Uh, I'd like to just touch on a point of Spurs are what well, were always known for an attacking style of brand. Now, the pers- closest person manager that we had to bring in that was Pochettino. If you look at what he did for us and the style of football we were playing, we, we, lots of people didn't want to play us. He consistently had us playing great football, competing at the top, in the Champions League season after season, and a Champions League final. He had a bad run for about six months and we went and sacked him. Look at the managerial appointments since then have been completely negative, un, un-Tottenham style football. So he's now gone out and got a guy who's, OK, done well in the, the Australia, in Australia, he's done well in the Japanese K-League and, and the Scottish League. But let, let's, let's be honest, you, you might as well be in League One in the, in the EFL. What are you talking about, James? What are you talking about? He's done well, James. 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 Come on, come mate. On. Come on. No, I'm being serious, mate. James, come on, mate. No, come on. Uh, You're an Arsenal fan. No, he has absolutely no, Jay. I'm not. I'm a realistic Spurs fan. He has absolutely no plan B. So if you hear his post-match c- c- uh, commentary, what did he say? Oh, yeah, mate. Yeah, yeah, we're going to learn from it. He's learned nothing. No. He's learned nothing. He takes off one player and puts the same player on. Uh, the same style of player on. He doesn't change anything at all. And I'm really concerned where we're going with this. <sighs> James... I mean, we've lost the day. I know it was a bad day at the office. I get it, and the players yeah, weren't good enough. Jamie, Jamie, but come on, I'm mate. Some of football, t- some of the football this season has been Very breathtaking. Yeah. We've been the, yeah, the, the team until, to be. Until, we've been the team to watch. Start, what do we expect? We we're not going to win the league, James. You're not going to win the until, league. Until, uh, no, I'm not saying we're going to win the league, Jamie. But, no, but we're fourth, we're fifth. We're going to get Champions League football. What do you want? We are just sold Harry Kane. Jamie, I'm going to bring you back up when we don't get Champions League football. We are going to get battered in our next four games, mate. We're not We're not going to give up 10 points to Newcastle, mate. We're not. Jamie, I, I'm, I am seriously concerned for the way we're playing right now. You know mate. what, though? Seriously. James, what I will say is that, like, I need more for Mans in his post-match interviews. He looks like a bit, exactly. like, cheeky answers. He's, he's, he's being sarcastic. Like, come out and say, so-and-so today wasn't good. Got to do well, better. <sighs> But you know what? Do you know what I heard from him today? What I've heard from him from today mm. was he almost seems nonchalant. Like, how dare you question what I was exactly. doing? Maybe wrong. What do you want and from him? What, we don't what like. do you want from him? Come out, come out and be honest and call yeah. out people. Call out the game. It just wasn't good enough. He's not going to call out his own players, is he? Straight after a game. Why That's not? Poor management. Let's stop, wrapping, let's stop wrapping everyone up in cotton wool. This is what Jamie got sacked for Billy Ricky. <laughs> James, he's too <laughs> soft. <laughs> You know, like, <laughs> James, like, you're not going to do that. You're not going to do that. You, you, you know, he, problem, he's had a bad yeah, day. The problem. Yeah, I'm sorry. I, I think football is getting picked too much nowadays. Uh, James, you, you you can't expect a manager to come out and hammer his players. All right? They've been, no, I didn't say everyone, hammer, but everyone knows saying, they've been poor today. We're gonna lo- stop saying it wasn't good enough. Oh, we're gonna the guy learn can't win. One minute they love his win. interviews. Next minute you hate his interviews. The, the, the guy can't win. Right. Spurs weren't good enough no. today. Spurs... We're four for a fifth football club. That's what we are. That, that, that's where our peak is at the moment. We're not Man City, we're not Arsenal, we're not Liverpool. So we're fighting it out for a fourth spot. That does not excuse performances and managerial decisions like he's been doing. You can't excuse that. I don't know. James, Sorry, you're mate. winding me up, mate. I, 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 <laughs> no, you are. Like, you're winding me up, James. Like, I don't know what you expect from Spurs. You know, like... No, I, no, no, we me. signed Timo Werner on loan for, like, you know, until the end of the season. What chart? Yeah. You know, that's what that's what we are. That's where we are. So you you think we're going to make top four this season, do you? I think we're going to get top five, which is Champions League. Not guaranteed. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, it's ninety nine percent. It's not. It's not. You know, well, I don't think. Not. I don't think we will. Let's have a conversation when we don't. Well, look. Oh. If we don't, then I the... hope we do, Jay. I'm, I'm desperate for it, but. I'm just trying to be realistic now. But James, can I ask you something though? Say you get top four, top five, you get Champions League football. You need a good summer, don't you? To really have a go in Champions League. Because Werner, not good enough to start. Johnson is a decent player, but he should be coming on for 15 minutes a game. You know, you've got players that like, Richardson's not, for me, good enough. You need better standard, don't you? but also, Gab, what's the plan B when we're found out? When teams have got us found out. Change, the, change the players with the same style. players, like you said. No, I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I get that. I, look, I get that. I do. But it's his first season. His first season in the Premier League. Spurs have been good, mate. They've been good. 
Yes, yes performances we, here and there we haven't been that great. But come on, give him a chance, we are. No I mean, come on, give him a chance, James. We have, but he's got to be better in the post-match interviews as well, yeah. James. Oh, what do you want? But, 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 James, you've got to look at, like, look what Conte was like, look what Mourinho was like, do you know Santo oh, was like? Like, So enjoy this, this, this season so far, because <laughs> uh, Spurs are probably the best team I've watched this season, football-wise. Entertainment. Uh, Can't win, mate. Can't win. Uh, uh, James, uh, listen, uh, we've got to go, mate. I appreciate your call. I do. It's a Spurs fans not happy, but... I actually had a read-up about um, in a newspaper about the fifth place. So I think it's it, the Italian league's got first at the moment. Then it's um, the Bundesliga. Then it's us, but it's tight. But it goes down to, for instance, Leverkusen and West Ham. Yeah. yeah Bayern yeah. Munich and Arsenal. Uh, let's go to Peter. He's a Newcastle fan. All right, Pete? Oh, Jimmy. Good evening, I Peter. Have a word with, can I have a word with Gabby first, please? Oh, oh no. FFP what have I done now? Well, go on, then. Gabby, you're about this FFP nonsense you do know. Aston Villa have an FFP club a list of as well, don't you, mate? So, I know when you're talking about Alexander Isak earlier. Yeah, good plan. And, and, if, and if any clubs want to buy him. How much would he cost Aston Villa, mate, to buy him? You just couldn't afford him. Sure. What about Spurs? Spurs, about 180 million. 180? <laughs> it's a bit steep, Pete. Pete we'll, Peter, we'll Peter, give you 80. We'll give Peter, you 80. Top players like Isaac want to play Champions League, mate. You can't offer it, that. It can, I, can I explain something to you, please, Gabby, please, about this FFP? You do know Aston Villa have also got to sell this summer, so you're in the same mess as we are, all because of the little cartel top six want their own little cartel of their own little Premier League. And clubs aren't allowed to compete, remember? That's not true, though, is it, really? Yes, it is true. We, it's not. But you're, you're the richest well, club in the world, you all vote, you, Peter. You all vote for it. The whole league votes for these things to come in. We, we're, the, we're the richest club in the world, but we're not allowed to spend because Manchester United, Liverpool, Arsenal, Tottenham decided they'll make the rules, they'll decide who can compete, they'll decide who can spend, and they'll decide who... Can it spend? That, that, that's not technically true, mate. Yes, it's you're not, 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 Peter, not, stop shouting at us, Peter. Pete, We're it's not, not true. Pete, it's not true. You all it's vote. True. Anything that happens in the Premier League, all the clubs vote on. It's a cartel, and it's always been a cartel. There's six clubs who are allowed to compete, and them six clubs, you've got Daniel and Levy who are sitting there today next to his best mate, Richard Masters, I wonder what rules do we decide and for next year? Pete, Pete, no, Pete, Pete you won 4 0 today, mate. Cheer up, I'm, yeah? I'm, I'm ecstatic we won because I know why. Because it'll stop Tottenham a cartel club getting in the Champions League. Peter, can I ask you one question, though, Peter? Yeah? If Aston Villa want to buy Isaac, how much do we have to pay for him, mate? 180 million. Okay. okay. That's what you think he's worth? 180 million. I, I think he's worth about 60, 60, 70. 60 I think Villa will pay that. <laughs> So, he's better than Ollie Watkins, who you value at how much? Um, 90, 90, 90 yeah, 100 yeah. for Ollie, I think. So, so Alexander Isaac, younger, he's better than him. And but you have to sell. Have you have to sell, you Peter. To You're worth, like, um, um, billions, but you can't... You, you have to sell. You don't have to sell this summer. It's all paper nonsense. You haven't got a clue. Pete, we, Pete, Pete, we'll give you 50 million for him. You haven't got a clue. We haven't got to sell this summer. And talk sport has been spouting that nonsense for months. And it's absolute Simon Jordan's it's told us. To listen to. So you know something? It's absolutely hilarious to listen to because you have been spouting FFP nonsense for three months and we don't have to sell. It's so funny. What about 130 for Gumirez and Isaac? Uh, well, Bill knows. Release cost is £150 million, so it wouldn't even get your Bruno. So, so. You get, so 150 and 180 for two players. Wow. That's a bit steep, yeah. mate. Come on. Not PSG here. Yeah. Well, we paid, let's be honest, we paid £63 million pounds for Isaac, and we're going to sell them for less than what we paid for them. Mm. Give it 55. When, when, when you've got, you got, you got to sell players, you have to sell them, you might get we a bit more. have to sell, Gabby. If you listen to what I'm saying, we don't have to sell. The papers have been talking nonsense for months. I read it in the papers that you have to sell. Oh, so you believe? So you believe your mates in the media than people who I understand it? No, you can support it. No smoke without fire, Pete. It's no true. smoke without fire. It's not true because next summer we'll be lining up. We'll have mm. Bruno in the team, 
Eva in the team. Mm. We'll have England's winger Anthony Gordon in the team. Mm. Mbappe. Oh, next thing. And who else? No. And then this summer we'll go out and spend another hundred and fifty million pounds on another three more world class players, mm. just mm. to annoy us even more. Mm. Yeah. Now, Pete, listen, you won today, mate. You won four nil. Cheer I, up. Get, I, I, I'm delighted. You know what I mean? I'm delighted we won because it means a top six cartel club will miss out on the champ. Do you know what I mean, Gabby? Yeah, I mate. actually want you to get in the Champions League. Oh, thank you, mate. Because it'll stop one of them cartel top six. Yeah, I agree, mate. Them Spurs, <laughs> cartels, Jamie. <laughs> Can we <laughs> with Gabby? Do you know what I remember about Tottenham? What was so funny about your club, Jamie? Yeah, go on. When, when you tried to join the European Super League. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, Peter. Good leg, Pete. Good Get into him, Peter. Good leg, Pete. Tottenham in the European, Tottenham in the European Super League. You've know, won the same as us in the past seventy years. What a big club! <laughs> big club, Pete. Big club, mate. You're trying to muscle in. You're not quite there yet. We'll have his sack off you, mate. We'll have him off you. Do you know what Tottenham are? Is it the Sunderland of London? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, Pete, good man. Top Brilliant. Jaw. Enjoy yourself, Pete. You know, you won 4 0. Enjoy yourself, Jamie. Mate, I right? think if he was next to you, I think he would have swung for us. Too. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this was a live event in Newcastle. <laughs> I happy. think he's jumping over. Yeah. And he's giving us a, a punch to the face. I'll give you 45 million for this, yeah. On AM, on DAB, via the Talk Sport app, and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.